माई डियर फ्रेंड्स इट इज बिलीव दैट द लैंग्वेज विथ विच द गॉड हैज रिटन दिस होल यूनिवर्स इज मैथमेटिक्स एंड आई एम ग्लैड टू इंट्रोड्यूस to one such beautiful topic of mathematics that comes as chapter 5 arithmetic progressions what is this arithmetic progressions i abbreviate this as a dot p this arithmetic progressions helps us in decoding nature we will work out here let's see check out what at all do we have to study in this chapter let's check out the agenda agenda goes like this a is of course introduction how did ap come into picture introduction to ap b b is if got it correct it is arithmetic progression progression itself that is ap c c is another term of an ap we will check out as to what it is and d is s suffix n that is sn which is equal to sum of n terms in an ap so i see so many things in nature my dear friends what i see in nature i see in nature sunflower this is how sunflower look likes the core of the sunflower having you know small seeds over there so we can find a pattern in it a spiral pattern right like this we see pine apple the outer surface of the pine apple it again follows a specific pattern a spiral pattern as you can see here similarly in honeycomb the cells follow in the honeycomb the cells follow a specific pattern and at the same time if you recollect bhutta that is maize in the, the grains of the on the main maize crop follows again a specific pattern as we see in the nature this all patterns have been decoded by our chapter arithmetic progression so let us get introduced to arithmetic progression so this agenda introduction is here and i introduce you to this arithmetic progression with the help of day to day life problems the real life problems which can actually be solved by arithmetic progression let me check out right with you guys i give you a simple situation there is a girl called reena must be graduated or post graduated with respect to her academics now she applied for a job got an interview right got through an interview and got selected and the company decided her salary that is payment per month will be equal to rupees 8000 that is rupees 8000 per month and at the same time depending upon her performance the annual increment what does that mean the increment per year will be equal to rupees 500 per month right so tell me my dear friend i ask you a simple question here what will be her incremented payment at the fifth year at the end of the fifth year what do you think let's check out in the first year reena ka payment kitna tha 8000 in the second year it will increment by how much 500 because annual increment is 500 so it will become 8500 third year bolo yes that is 9000 fourth year yes 9500 Fifth year, it has to be what ten thousand. So what we see, eight thousand ka eight thousand pass so from eight thousand to eight thousand five hundred. There is increment of plus five hundred. Again plus five hundred added to eight thousand five hundred. It is nine thousand. Again nine thousand got added to plus five hundred. You know nine thousand five hundred. And finally again five hundred added. So it becomes ten thousand. This is how the AP looks like. Let me let me define later what is AP in our second part. Right. now in uh, i said i am giving you practical real life situations of ap ap is such a thing which keeps on you know increasing with a fixed value so if i see this uh, you know cd that is ladder this is a ladder and now this ladder is bit different uh, this is you know we use in our you know household uh, works right so this ladder is a converging ladder like this now this ladders have those you know what we say the patties that is nothing but rungs they are known as rungs so there are so many rungs so i measured the lowest rung the bottom rung it i found it to be 45 cm 
and when i moved up i saw i found i measured the uh, you know the second last you know uh, that run the second last run was run was found out to be yes it comes comes out to be 43 cm and thereafter the next run came and it becomes what 41 then what will happen what do you think what is happening simple what is happening i give you simple calculation first run had 45 cm above that it had was 43 it was 43 then it came to third it becomes 41 that means they are getting decreased by 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 so what will be the fourth yes it is 39 so what will be the eighth answer now 39 minus 2 will be 37 37 minus 2 would give us the above run what is that 37 minus 2 35 35 minus 2 yes 33 33 minus 2 31 so 31 is nothing but here we can see from 45 to 8 rung when we go it becomes 31 centimeter so again this rungs of the ladder follow what pattern a specific pattern a specific progression that is known as arithmetic progression my dear friends i am glad to tell you a beautiful example example which helps us decoding various secrets in the nature as i told you in our introduction and this is really beautiful in terms of the story i am going to show you a specific pattern known as fibonacci pattern what is fibonacci pattern let's see with the help of a beautiful story of you know a couple of rabbits bunnies you know bunnies right you are my humpty dumpty hello honey bunny so i take honey bunny right as two bunnies here comes a pair of two rabbits they are too young they fell in love with each other and they thought of getting married in the month of december so december they got married but they were too young so the thing is first month they are being too young they were unable to produce kids right and the rule is second month they start producing kit and every subsequent months after that they keep on producing kits this is applicable to all new pairs does you know produced right so first month december month they got married they are too young in the second month they got matured they became adult now they started you know family planning as we do human beings they also do the bunnies are the same so they started family planning and they thought of you know producing kids so after second month in the second month we have again one pair in the first month december we have one pair in the second month january we have one pair but in the third month that is the month of february this matured parents have produced kids you know newborn rabbits so these are the newborn rabbits so already parents to the or ye newborn babies aage to kitne ho gaye in the month of february there were yes two pair of rabbits right now next comes the month of february ke baad kya aata hai march tell me my dear friends now mature wale parents they will keep on producing kids so this parent produces one more you know pair of rabbits right but ye log to rahenge na parivar mein so they will be there how many pair two pairs and yes and those younger ones are too young to produce so they will also remain kyunki wo to young hai to abhi un log bachche paida nahi karenge so they will remain how many in the month of march yes three right now in the month of april let me check out jo ekdam naye born hue abhi aap dekh sakte ho wo to produce nahi karenge पेरेंट्स फिर से प्रोड्यूस करेंगे कितने होंगे दो पेरेंट्स तो पेरेंट्स ही रहेंगे कितने होंगे तीन देर आर थ्री आर यू गेटिंग माई पॉइंट नाउ दो parents who have now become mature those older babies now have become matured enough to produce kids to unke kids aur wo khud char aur paanch to to kitne hote five are you getting my point now my simple question what are the number of pairs at the end of the sixth month kaun batayega abhi tak kitna hua let's see in the first month it was one pair in the second month it was again one pair in the third month 
this is two and in the fourth month it is nothing but three right and in the month of i said december january february march april it was five so tell me at the end of six months how much it will be yes it will be as i can see the pattern one plus one is two right two plus one is three three plus two is five so therefore 5 plus 3 will be 8. This 8 can be verified in this diagram. As you can see arrows in the diagram properly. So this speaks volume. There will be 8 pairs. And such a you know pattern, such a pattern is known as Fibonacci sequence or pattern. So my dear friends, let me check out the pattern that can be seen here in a specific geometrical manner. So what I take, I take one by one couple and I put them in a box, in a square box. So first month, first box, this is square box, one. You know, in the second month, that is the month of January, again, they remain the same, they have become matured. So there are two boxes back to back, one, 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 right? Now, first month, one, one pair, second month, one pair. But in the third month, as we can say, February, February, in the month of February, what we see? there is a newborn baby so it must be two so there is a square which is showing two over one and one this two you know once now in the next consecutive month you know what will happen it has to be three because uh, two plus one is three then this box will be three the, as you can see three here also right now this three and this two 1 plus 1, 2 and this 3 becomes 5. So there is a box below, square box below which represents 5. Now this 5 and above box length is, yes 3. 5 plus 3 is 8. As we can see there are 8 rabbits, rabbits in the 6 month. So 8. Now I can keep on going like this. So what I will do, I will draw this semicircle starting from this vertex. I draw a semicircle from or with the base as 1 and 1, right, with the diameter as 1, 1, 1. And a quarter circle from here over 2. Then again quarter circle over 3. And then 5 and then 8. And it keeps on going like a spiral. Where do you see this spiral? The spiral can be seen in in sunflower seeds of sunflower like this it can be seen in yes pineapples the outer surface of the pineapple like this it can also be seen in you know uh, maize cob the grains of the main co cob and of course it can be seen in honeycomb isn't that interesting that nature actually follows a pattern which can be decoded with this you know pattern which is known as Fibonacci Fibonacci pattern pattern or Fibonacci basically we can pronounce in both ways the famous is Fibonacci pattern so let's study now arithmetic progression so what we observe this is a rectangle but this is known as golden rectangle this Fibonacci you know pattern or sequence or progression whatever we say it is a it is having this spiral shape and this is known as golden rectangle because the ratio which was found out a specific ratio is known as golden ratio I will talk about this at length right later now what we observe in our introduction we have seen the examples of arithmetic progression that is uh, AP what we say in day-to-day -day life in terms of Rina salary in terms of ladder, its rungs, the length of the rungs. In terms of bunny, that is bunny's pair of you know rabbits and their offsprings like this. And they all follow a fixed pattern. So in the entire universe that we have around, we are filled with arithmetic progressions. Now let me define arithmetic progression in our next part that is part B.